Yo, yo, we are back in After Effects. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to create this really cool duplication effect of your character. It was done in brand new Young Phase of music video. It was totally dope. And similar effects was done in Lil Atty and Ian Hit Me music video. It gone like really viral. So I'm going to show you how to create this. So in my timeline, you can see I got this clip right here, which I'm going to make the effect on. So firstly, selecting your clip, start by hitting Ctrl D on your key keyboard to duplicate your clip then just take your roto brush tool and simply rotoscope out your subject something like that if you're doing this effect with your music video make sure like the background is kind of a solid color so the rotoscope is a lot easier and it blends in more and also make sure it is shot on tripod so we don't have to track like cameras and stuff but anyways let's just rotoscope him out real quick i think that's a pretty cool rotoscope right there so i'm gonna freeze it and wait till it freezes now if i pop back into my composition you can see my subject is rotoscoped out if i hide my background layer that's exactly what we want also you can mess with the feathers and the shift is if you like of it but it really doesn't matter you can also like rename it i'm gonna rename it roto like that then you can just enable your background clip now we're gonna again duplicate this by hitting ctrl d and just select another one which is below your duplication and just hit s to bring up the scale and you can just scale it up a little bit like 130 at first then you can just put it at one side like that and also duplicate this and put another on the another side something like that just eyeball it to your liking that looks pretty cool right there then duplicate one of the rotos again and just scale it up once more let's just scale it up more and put it at one side you can even play with the position if you like bring up the scale and also duplicate this and put one at another side like that also a quick tip while you play with your position make sure you hold shift and it should move in like a guideline if that makes sense but again i'm gonna duplicate another one i'm gonna make another duplication and put one at side and bring up the scale as well so it like scales up as it goes and then you can duplicate that as well and reposition it on the another side now we can see it already looks cool but we're gonna select all of our duplication rotos and just right click and hit pre-comp like that and add like an optic compensation on here and bring up the amount of it so something like that that looks really cool and then our radial blur just to add some blur on it you can lower down the amount to something like five or four even and you can play with the type i like to set it to zoom for now but you can also set it to spin it looks really cool uh let's just bring up the amount more i guess that looks really dope right there now we're gonna add the zoom so to add the zoom i like to create a new null object and parent all of my clip onto it and just hit the stopwatch in the scale and go a bit further scale it in uh, somewhere around here and go a bit further again and scale it out then you can just easy those keyframes go into graph and make a graph something like this so it's like really smooth and this is my graph right here if you want to copy the graph and it looks so smooth right now but we're gonna turn on the motion blur for all of those so we have those smooth motion blur as well and now to top it all off we're gonna pre-comp this and then add like a flicker on this and bring up the amplitude and lower down the frequency of it to something like 10 so it's like really slow like in the music video they did so finally my effect looks something like this so that's it for today's video guys if you like this video please consider hitting the like button and this was a really quick one but it looked really cool you can subscribe me for more videos like this and check my digital store i have a lot of cool editing pack in there like some six title or grunge fx you already know so yeah see you in next video Peace.